Good morning students. Uh, I will be your new English teacher. My name is Manoj Mathieu and hope you understand this is an online class. So based on this online class there will be more advantages and at the same time there will be more disadvantages that I will not be able to interact you very personally. So this will be a recorded lesson. Uh, each class will be more useful for you because you can sit at home and learn. Uh, according to your convenience so every chapter I will explain all literature and grammar both in English and Hindi so I hope that you are uh, you are new to me at the same time I'm also new to you right so let's learn together and let's utilize this online platform to learn better and best okay so uh, so this is the lesson for uh, lecture for 8th standard so I don't know how many students are there in 8th standard but still this is a lesson for you uh, hope you will find it more useful uh, English is only a language okay English is a language so what we say in English we can say 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 so English is only a language so अंग्रेजी सीखने के लिए हमको क्या चाहिए? So we should have a, uh, an aim. हम हमारे सामने अच्छा मॉडल चाहिए कि हम क्यों सीख रहे? कुछ भी सीखना है उसके पीछे एक तो रीज़न तो होगा ना वजह ढूँढना है कि why do we learn English? And English is a very easy language that you can easily learn if you have such a kind of uh, perfect aim in your mind that is already set. Uh, if you don't understand, please let me know in the comment box, okay? Uh, I will be trying to explain things very slowly. Dheere dheere aapko sab kuch explain karke dunga. And aapko jo samajh mein nahi aaga, please aap comment box mein bata dena. I hope you are watching this uh, in our school platform, school YouTube, YouTube platform, right? Okay. So, uh, otherwise I will be giving you my WhatsApp number so you can contact me personally. Okay, fine. Uh, literature is uh, the literature. Uh, grammar grammar bhi hota hai, literature is the literature in our language. Mein, okay? So, um, why do we learn all this? Actually, it will definitely help you to know uh, why the language, English language is very important. Okay? You know, in this world, the most important language or the mostly spoken language is English. So, if you know English, then you can travel to any countries and contact people and you can just communicate and transfer your ideas in a convenient way so this is one of the biggest advantages of learning English and, and another thing is that if you learn English then you can easily crack any competitive exams that will definitely help you to uh, get an admission in foreign universities for your further studies if your English is good, you will have to crack any competitive exam in a foreign university or a good university in a top ranking university you will get admission to study for further studies so this is a great advantage of English language another thing is that the reason why we learn English is to know every concept that are mostly written in English language which is logical कितना भी अच्छे-अच्छे books लिखा हो, most of the books they are written English में लिखा हुआ है ना, तो अगर आप English में read करके आपको समझ में आएगा, तो it's one of the big बड़ा advantage हो जाता है आपको English सीख, आप English सीखने से, so one thing I would like to tell you that my English, my Hindi is not up to high level, okay, मेरा Hindi भी इतना perfect नहीं, but I hope that you can understand my Hindi, मैं ऐसा इच्छा रखता हूँ कि मेरा Hindi आपको समझ में आए so yeah so it will be a good uh, chance for me and for you to see each other on this platform and please stay home stay safe because this is it's a very big critical situation of our country and the world and due to COVID-19 coronavirus transmissions so please stay home and stay safe and learn whenever you get a chance to learn something new okay Today I uh, just want to tell you uh, something about myself and I would like to also know about more but 
since it is online class uh, you will not be able to see each, each one of your face and ask some personal questions so now I am going to ask you some questions in English see uh, I am very sure I am confident that you can understand my English since you are in 8th standard right so 8th standard student ka student bache ko kafi English to acha aata hai to aapko you should be you should feel proud that uh, you can understand English you can learn English and you can speak English well good so some of the questions that I would like to ask you now so please answer me uh, whenever uh, while you watch this video okay ab jaise aap mera question sunte aap usko reply dena theek hai main aapko thoda time dunga to aap usko answer de dena theek hai and one thing i would like to request you that whenever my lecture comes jab bhi mera class aapko hoga to aap ek notebook aur pen ya pencil rakh dena aur textbook ka copy aapko already mil hi jayega from school management aapko provide kiya jayega एंड ग्रामर टॉपिक्स जो भी सिखाएगा तो आपकी क्लास एट के हिसाब से मैं आपको सिखाऊंगा तो पोर्शन वाइज पोर्शन नहीं बट एनसीआर टी सिलेबस के रिलेटेड जो भी कंटेंट आपको इम्पोर्टेंट है फर्स्ट सेमेस्टर में उस हिसाब से आई विल स्टार्ट मैं आपको आपके लिए शुरू करूंगी ग्रामर पोर्शन ओके एंड ओके सम क्वेश्चन आई वुड लाइक टू आस्क यू दैट वाई डू यू लर्न इंग्लिश वट इज द रीजन वाई द रीजन बिहाइंड वाई यू लर्न इंग्लिश Did you get me what I asked? Why do you learn English language? You have to respond yourself. Okay, uh, I don't know what you say, but I uh, I am sure that this practice will definitely help you to just think in English. English में English में सोचने के लिए आपको बड़ा फायदा मिलेगा. जो जे whatever the जो भी क्वेश्चन मैं आपको अभी दे रहा हूँ, वो सब आप सोच लो. Okay, answer देने के लिए. So the first question is that. Why do I will just write it on board? Okay, if you did not hear me clearly, yeah. Why do you learn English? So this is the first question, and I want your answer. The reason why you learn English language. Then after, once your turn is over, I will give my own answers. what i think and what eighth standard level students mostly think about this question and based on their perspective un logon ke soch mein ye question ka answer kya hoga main aapko bataunga but first aap pehle mere ko answer de do why do you learn english yeah okay uh जो आंसर मेरे मन में आ रहे जो मेरा टीचिंग एक्सपीरियंस में जो भी स्टूडेंट्स मेरे को बताया गया है मैं आपके साथ शेयर कर रहा हूँ वेन आई आस्क दिस क्वेश्चन व्हाई डू यू लर्न इंग्लिश मोस्टली स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ क्लास एट दे सी दैट सर वी वांट टू ट्रैवल टू अमेरिका और यूके और एनी काइंड ऑफ इंग्लिश स्पीकिंग कंट्रीज टू परस्यू आवर टू कंटिन्यू आवर स्टडीज आफ्टर कम्प्लीटिंग आवर ट्वेल्थ और डिग्री Uh, हमको फॉरिन में जाना है जहाँ इंग्लिश बोला जाता है वहां जाके कोई भी यूनिवर्सिटी में हमको एडमिशन लेना है फिर हमारा कंटिन्यू स्टडी कंटिन्यू करना है तो ये आंसर कोई स्टूडेंट्स बोलता है वी वांट टू लर्न इंग्लिश बिकॉज वी वांट टू वी वांट टू ट्रैवल टू एनी इंग्लिश स्पीकिंग कंट्रीज टू स्टडी दर टू स्टडी इन दर यूनिवर्सिटी दिस कैन बी ए दिस कैन बी एन आंसर टू दिस क्वेश्चन and second answer mostly students say that sir we want to talk to foreign people we want to talk to foreign people humko foreign aadmi logon ke sath english mein baat karna pasand lagta hai acha lagta hai chatting karne ke liye ya koi bhi foreign se koi bhi aaye gaye to humko un logon ke sath baat karne ke liye to english to zaruri hai right so english learning wo kam aayega jo koi bhi bahar se aate hai उन लोगों के साथ बात करने के लिए सो दैट ये भी एक अच्छे आंसर होते हैं दिस सोर्स वन है ए गुड आंसर टू दिस क्वेश्चन या अनदर आंसर कैन बी वी वांट टू लर्न इंग्लिश बिकॉज वी वांट टू रीड मोर बुक्स 
because most of the good books that are written in English language. So, if you know if you know English language, we can read and understand all the books. So, ये answer जो students बोलते हैं normally reading करना पसंद ज़्यादा करता होगा, right? जिसको ज़्यादा reading करना अच्छा लगता है, वो लोग English इसलिए सीखता है कि they can वो लोगों को जो भी इंग्लिश में लिखा हुआ है बुक्स रीड करके समझ सकता है सो द फर्स्ट आंसर दैट आई टोल्ड यू टू दिस क्वेश्चन दैट पीपल वुड लाइक टू ट्रैक आई होप माय हैंड रेडिंग इज क्लियर टू यू राइट दिस इज आर सो द फर्स्ट पॉसिबल आंसर कैन बी फ्रॉम द लेवल ऑफ एज स्टैंडर्ड स्टूडेंट्स to the question why do you learn english language so that first they will normally say they want to travel to different countries it's a good answer uh, we would like to travel to english speaking countries this is one of the reasons normally students or people learn english language and the second one is that they normally give answer to related to their studies future studies future study uh, I am very happy to tell you one thing that most of my students are in many of the foreign universities they are pursuing and they are continuing their studies after cracking some competitive exams like IELTS uh, TOEFL koi koi competitive exams jaise IELTS aapne suna hoga ये सब कुछ ये सब कॉम्पिटिटिव एग्जाम्स पास होके कोई भी फॉरेन यूनिवर्सिटी में लोग एडमिशन मिल जाते हैं तो मोस्ट ऑफ माय स्टूडेंट्स मेरा काफी स्टूडेंट्स ऐसे मोस्ट ऑफ द यूके अमेरिका ऑस्ट्रेलिया ऐसे ऐसे बहुत सारे अच्छे अच्छे यूनिवर्सिटी में स्टडी कर तो लोगों का एम अभी क्लियर हो गया फ्यूचर स्टडीज करने के लिए इंग्लिश सीख रहे थे सो थर्ड आंसर क्या बोल रहा मैंने ट्रेवल का पर्पज Physics studies cover. Yeah, third one is to read more books. To read more books. बहुत सारा books read करने के लिए काम आएगा. Because I told you that most of the good books uh, nowadays, most of the books that are written in English are also translated to different different languages. Okay, and I hope that my students, most of you are from mostly you are from Gujarat, right? I am not from Gujarat. I don't know Gujarati language, but can understand little bit. But I hope you are my students who are watching this video are mostly from Gujarat, Gujarat state. So in your language, uh, many books are available, but the original books, most of the original books that are written in English language are translated to uh, many many Indian uh, local languages. Okay. I don't know how many books are uh, originally available in Gujarati, but mostly good books are. Always available in English language because it is originally written in English language. Even though it is not written in English language, uh, most of the books are translated to uh, English language and it's available also in this language. So this is one of the beautiful aspects of English language. So these are the three aspects. Normally, whenever I ask the question to eight standard students, they normally say, "I don't know." Many um, actually. I am not able to hear you now, right? Because it is just a recorded lecture. So, if you are able to comment me in my personal WhatsApp or here in this video behind, just below, there is a comment option. If it is possible, then please let me know that your answer. What did you think? What do you think? This question. So, what do you think? What answer do you think? Please comment box me. Tell me. So that I can understand how many of you will, how many of you are watching this video. And how many of you are able to understand what I say? जितना लोगों को मैंने क्या-क्या बोला वो समझ में आया और जितना लोग देख रहे हैं तो आपके कमेंट देके मुझे समझ में आएगा actually, right? So this is the first question that was for you. So the next question that I would like to ask you is that. Uh, see in every class, the since you are in eight uh, coming classes, you will be going to nine, ten, eleven. So 
two sections of gra uh, two sections of english language you will be learning like literature the one part is literature this is and the second one what normally you learn is grammar the grammar ke jo words sunte hai kisi kisi ko chakar aata hoga right kisi kisi ko itna acha nahi lagta grammar but it's very easy i will make you to understand each concept very clearly okay Uh, if you have that interest, आपको थोड़ा भी इंटरेस्ट होगा ना तो बहुत इजी आसन तरीका से ग्रामर सीख सकते हैं सो द क्वेश्चन फॉर यू इज दैट वॉट डू यू थिंक द डिफरेंस बिटवीन लिटरेचर एंड ग्रामर द क्वेश्चन फॉर यू माई एट स्टैंडर्ड स्टूडेंट्स इज दैट यूर लेवल ऑफ थिंकिंग इज लिटिल बिट हायर कम्पेयर टू स्मॉल क्लासेस जो छोटे क्लास के बच्चे से ज्यादा आपका लेवल ऑफ थिंकिंग थोड़ा हायर होता है इसलिए मैं आपके साथ ये जब क्वेश्चन आपको बार बार पूछ रहे वाट इज द डिफरेंस बिटवीन माई क्वेश्चन टू इज दैट वाट इज वाट डू यू थिंक द डिफरेंस बिटवीन लिटरेचर एंड ग्रामर आपके माइंड में क्या आंसर आता है लिटरेचर और ग्रामर के बारे में जो डिफरेंस क्या फर्क है यू थिंक आप सोच लो फिर मुझे आंसर बता दो आई डोट इन कमेंट बॉक्स और पर्सनली और यू जस्ट राइट डाउन इन यूर नोटबुक आपकी नोटबुक में आपके पास जो अवेलेबल है ना उसमें लिख के लिखे जाओ ये आप क्या क्या डिफरेंस आप सोच सकते हैं आपके माइंड में क्या क्या आ रहा है बिटवीन लिटरेचर एंड ग्रामर ओके सो वट एवर यू हैव थॉट लेट इट बी एस इट इज सो आई विल मेक यू क्लियर वन थिंग दैट इन लिटरेचर देर आर मेनी सब डिविशन दैट वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न इन दिस First semester of your class textbook. Literature can be many many content based. Many contents is ki under hota hai. Can you say something? Some of the contents that we normally last year we have ne bhot kuch sikha hai. Jaise kaun si class? Jab se aap English learn karna shuru kiya tab se aap literature ki under bhot saara chiz. Jo literature ka hi hai, aap sikha hai. Kya kya ho sakta hai? Can can you tell me some of the ideas? The first thing that I would like to share is poem. Okay, बहुत सारा poem हम सीखते हैं ना. So this comes under the category of literature. And the next one, what can be? Story. स्टोरीज क्या बोलते उसके हिंदी स्टोरीज कहानी राइट सो भी कहानी भी हम सुनता है बोलता है सीखता है भी लिटरेचर के अंदर पोएम स्टोरी एंड एनी अदर थिंग्स मेनली दीज टू थिंग्स कम्स अंडर लिटरेचर ओके एंड देर आर मेनी अदर थिंग्स दैट यू विल डिस्कस इन लेटर लेटर कमिंग लेक्चर्स राइट सो दिस इज क्लियर फॉर यू राइट poem stories short stories this all comes under literature means this is the beautiful it is remains the beautiful explanation of any literary devices beautiful explanation of uh person uh beautiful explanation of place beautiful explanation of things kisi bhi cheez ke bare mein ekdam acha tarika se mast explanation deta hai poem ki tarah ya story ki tarah तो लिटरेचर में आई जाता है ठीक है हमारा टेक्स्ट बुक में भी है बहुत सारा पोएम्स और स्टोरीज सो वी लर्न अबाउट ऑल दो ग्रामर क्या होता है ग्रामर इज नॉर्मली द बाइक बोन सी वी आर ह्यूमन बींग्स राइट सो हम ह्यूमन बींग हमको एकदम सही तरीके से जस्ट लाइक यू कैन सी हियर द मार्कर ओके द मार्कर इज एस इट इज स्ट्रेट If there is no support, what will happen? अगर सपोर्ट नहीं है तो ये गिर जाता है ठीक है नीचे गिर जाता है तो सेम वे सिंस वी आर ह्यूमन बींग्स वी शुड हैव वन रिक्वायर्ड थिंग दैट मेक अस टू स्टैंड स्ट्रेट जो हमारा बॉडी को एकदम सही तरीका से खड़े रखने के लिए एक चीज का जरूरत होती है वॉट इज दैट या बैकबोन जो हमारा बैकबोन स्ट्रांग नहीं है तो वी आर नॉट एबल टू स्टैंड प्रॉपरली राइट 
my erection proper uh, body posture will not be uh, correct mare jo backbone itna supportive nahi hota to hum seedha khade nahi rahte the same way in english language the beauty and the strength of english language defines based on the quality grammar you know jitna acha grammar aapko aata hai utna achhi tarike se aapko english mein baat karne aayega aur aapko grammar sahi tarike se aata hai to koi bhi cheez ab koi bhi english mein text se ab read karke aa raha aasan tarike se samajh sakta hai so this is this is the biggest advantage of learning grammar so literature and grammar these two are correlated in english language and english is only a language it is not a medium to define about a person where whether he or she is super talented or not so no english is only a language okay so you have to keep it in your mind english is only a medium to communicate to understand facts and everything so the first lecture is almost going to finish here and i have given only a basic idea about why we learn english language some of the questions i have asked and the difference between literature and grammar okay so what do i have talk to you discuss with you i hope you understood if you have not understood agar aapko samajh mein nahi aaya to please zarur aap comment box mein bata dena theek hai otherwise i cannot understand whether you have understood or not samajh mein nahi aaya mere ko bhi ki aapko samajh mein aaya ki nahi so please let me know personally or in the comment box below because you are watching this video Uh, on youtube platform of our school okay so stay home stay safe we will meet in the next lecture uh, there we will just begin uh, some either poem or stories okay so see you there have a nice day